a lot of water. On to another mine. On to another level. Let's do this. And always, my work is danger of death. Got to be taken seriously in these places. Let's see. Falls flooded. We definitely we don't want to be treading on. Not to be stepped on, definitely. From above there. Let's go see. And there, it's back out to the other the portal. Moth. Nature. Nature is at its best. Greatest spot if we can get creature. Oh, here we're coming to some big stokes. Wow, a lot of timber above us. That's oh, really nice. Look at that. Yeah, nice tall section like the level below us. Same layout. Oh, you can see the the temple holes, don't you? Yeah, and then where the last so, the wall, so it went into the top. There was a timber like this, basically, right there, going from that socket there to the left wall. Yeah. It just, it, it would just fit uh, the average size tree that a bit dressed. There seems to be a ledge over there. Is there a level above us? Yeah, yeah, you'll see the light now coming through. Yeah. And then, uh, when we go back out this, uh, if you walk a little bit further up the hill, you'll be at the origins of the waterfall. So the waterfall comes from the mountain through this one and then down into the next one where we were oh, just. Oh, yeah, wow. So it's, uh, you can see it where it comes off. The oh, we can see some daylight in the distance. That's going to be amazing. This is, this is yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That's something special, that. You can see the daylight coming right through there. There's a shaft there. So, I'm just walking up this spoil tip and you can see shaft right up there and a lot of that stacked up there on this timber platform yeah it's absolutely mad wow this place is beautiful look at this Wow. Oh my god. So you could descend down off that SRT if you wanted to on that one straight into here as well. Yeah, you would need uh, a, a very good wetsuit or dry weather really. You know, um, you know in the last added we were in, yeah. uh, the waterfall, yeah. there it is there. That's where it comes to. That's, so we just ran through the last level the that we've been. That's where it goes down to yeah. the waterfall. That's incredible. 
That is absolutely incredible. Wow. Never seen anything quite like this. Full trees. Just a stempling ton of rocks above us. And that's where it goes down. Yeah, so we were at the bottom there. Wow. So that's where we just ran through the waterfall. And that's where the water disappears. Any volunteers to go down? <laughs> wow. Look how fast they are. And look how straight they are as well. Incredible. Yeah, the timber work is just simply magnificent, isn't it? It's a massive amount of work there. Yeah. The forces were holding that up. It's a full, a full big adult tree, basically. That's yeah. just been caught into size. And I wonder if they were still like, the same tree. Put, like just cut down to like say five meters or so yeah because they do look pretty much identical and they're like the same thickness they are they could be the same tree that's yeah. been cut down into different sizes yeah i'll let you go wow this is incredible isn't it you have the straw oh it's yours too is it no 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 it's yours your headlight is strobing yeah <laughs> Utility hooks here. This is this is a treat, is it? I didn't expect it. I know it was full. I didn't expect it to be this full. You know. This is something else. The of the wow. That uh, waterfall comes in and then works its way down there. But I don't know if you can see the, the tunnel underneath there. The level, yeah. Yeah. Are we going through there? No, we've ah. never been through there because of the flooding, the way yeah. this is backed against us. Um, and then as we come here, I don't know if you can see it, but like you can see suddenly like how much it drops. So yeah. like, I don't, we haven't been any further than this. But it doesn't seem to go anyway. No, if you... Or if maybe it does. If you pass through that process. Yeah. See, see, I can feel a hole underneath your feet. So you've got a, a gap that you can get through, but it's like almost like swimming. So there's a... So there's a, like a, a gap just underneath there. And it looks like you can swim through it. Yeah, you probably but can. With this amount of water, I wouldn't trust it. No, no, like, no. It's a lot of water. We're going on what? That's a lot of water coming down. A lot of water. Right here, I know. That's incredible, isn't it? It's amazing. It's amazing. Wow. You're taking long videos, mate. Come on then. <laughs> no. Oh, here. Okay. Two, two feet and you're up to your ball. And it's still going down. I think we're going to pass on this one, are we? <laughs> the old awesome stuff. Oh, that's cool, that. They would have just backed the train right up from there. Yeah. We need to come in dry season. Right, and so the tracks are all there, but it looks like you have to swim. So like you have to, it's like the whole is literally about that much. 
stopping this guy's not the room, he's going in there. It's pretty incredible this, I'm absolutely mesmerised. It's the second time this new Fenix has gone out and he died. He would start flashing everyone. Yeah. Uh, you, you need a new light, a new uh, battery probably. It's brand new. Is it? It's the second time it's been out. So maybe four hours it's been in use. I'll take a look. Oh, I'll have a look. They're pretty nice though, it's 125 quid. It's a battery. Yeah, they're good. Not bad for a head. There's the HM71R. Uh, That's it, yeah. That's the one I use, yeah. I'm very pleased with it. Yeah, the spotlight is really bright, I've got to give it. Yeah. I prefer the floodlight, the floodlight's really good on yeah. it. Yeah. Oh, I can't do it with the kids, it was amazing, it doesn't blind anyone, it's just at people. Go up to what's the lumen on that thing? There's something silly. 2000 maximum. How much tin? 2000. Right, if yeah. you combine both. <laughs> yeah, no, it does the job, does it? Yeah, it really does. And you can get the spotlight right up to the top. See, for these slate mines we go to, my torches are turned. I've got like big torches in the thing. Yeah. I didn't bother because there's so many of us today. Well, the slate mines, so any big mines, this is where you need the really, really LR40R. Really. Uh, version 2.0. I'm bidding on one the LR80R yeah. at the moment, it's like 200 quid they on eBay big, at the moment. Yeah. But it looks a bit heavy to carry They are a bit around. too heavy to my liking. Yeah, yeah, that's what I thought. This is just right. I've it's got a good to like... compromise between power and heavy. Yeah. You know, great power and not too heavy. Rechargeable. You have to recharge it every time, but the battery power, the battery lasts you for ages. It lasts you full trip. As long as you don't keep it constantly on, obviously. Where are they made? It's, all, it's a British made, isn't it, as well? Is it? Eh? Are they all like a Cornwall no. or something? There's, a, from, are there's they? a, a British distributor. I'll pass you the link to this, anyway. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The link is in the description of this, on the, on, of every video as well. Right, yeah. But I'll pass it to you, yeah? yeah. Send me a discount code. I'll today. give you the discount code, yeah, definitely. <laughs> oh, but you said I'm just getting Yeah. And obviously, I'm going to switch my light off. Switch your lights off a bit. But yeah. you can see the... Yeah. Well, you need to switch them fully off, it's fine. And you can see the uh, the perspective of the natural light coming in. Yeah, it's crazy. To the open stop above, that's about 30, 40 meters above us, so 120 foot at least, I would say. To the very top, probably more. A five minute walk from the entrance, and you'll be at the top there, looking down. Awesome, so let's uh, do that. It is that's quite, gonna be worth it. It is quite impressive. It is very impressive. And I've never seen it with that much water coming off it. This would be a good place for the photography. I've seen Something pictures, like yeah, I've seen pictures of this place, but never realised how amazing it is it's when you see it with your eyes. Right. You can't, I can't, you can't explain that till you come around and look at it, innit? Yeah. And it's not even that, really, it's not even that bad, like, you know, getting in. Yeah. It's, you just got to be careful of the entrance with the city, but that's about it. We are going to get to the top of the level the week where we could see the daylight coming through and I think that's the open open car, open uh, rake Wow, there's some uh, some lead right there you can see some lead or this is what they were mining mostly lead and also zinc that should be a spectacular views of there I can see already the waterfall going in wow And we come to the waterfall. Wow. Whoa. Nearly the top of the mountains we are. Incredible scenery all around us. One place we don't want to get too close. 
Antonio. Yeah, okay. So we're gonna stay away from the well, false floor. It, it, it is pretty, it's a bit like, I'm not gonna use the word safe, but it's like, you can have a look at like, how it was constructed. Oh my God, yeah. And then we're gonna stop by like where Dave is, there's actually a hole that you can see the timbers underneath. That is basically, we're on a false floor. We're Gareth and Artie yeah. No, that's amazing. Dave, have you taken a footage from here, looking there, with someone? Yeah, it gives perspective, does it? Wow. <laughs> I want to climb up there, but if it goes wrong, it's going to go wrong. Yeah. So I'm not oh yeah, I know what. No worth it. Well, you can reach with the camera, can you? That's the thing. Wow. This was uh, another highlight. It's just so beautiful to see water disappearing. I wish I could have brought you here on a sunny day. Yeah. More beautiful then. Oh, yeah. That would just be a reason to come back when it's sunny. Yeah, these foil heats up here are just such treasures. Isn't it? They really have. It's incredible. This place uh, is incredible, the valley. There's so many mines to explore, so many, so much to discover. Don't slip away. <laughs> You're gonna go. Are you slipping away? Yeah, yeah. yeah. This, this isn't good for my boots. It's Don't a long way to go down here. Eh? It's a long way to roll. <laughs> Thank you. Just have a look at it. Some great views here. It's amazing, isn't it? Yes, of course. It's incredible this this valley, how steep it is. Full of mine working everywhere. I think I think that's where we're going next. I can see like a fenced area there that could be mines. Looks to be. There's Dave, Dave coming his way. There you are, now you're coming down fast, are you then? Let's go right there. Yeah, there we go. Hey. It's not iron oxide on my hand. What is it? Leather gloves <laughs> that are yellow. Oh, it's the gloves. <laughs> I thought they had a tint. Well, that's an easy way in, is it? You don't have to climb uh, a fence for a change, hey? Yeah. Oh, oh wow, what's this? What is this? Right. Is this a wheel pit? Yeah, but that is... This is where the water wheel was sat, most likely, is it? Yeah. That drop is what you can only describe as bottomless. You can't even see the bottom, but see how it slopes off? Yeah. So you can't even get anywhere near the No, I'm there. not going to get any closer, but... You can get a bit of a better view from the top, but yeah, from down there, you you, you just can't get... It looks terrifying just it's, standing yeah, where I am. Yeah. it's The way it slopes off, though, you can tell it was used for pulling. 
Yeah. Yeah, so, this, it's definitely a real pit. Um, let's take a view from the top, yeah. It was more than likely to pull out from the inside. And then, uh, really, you can't stand any closer than this because it'd be stupid. But God, that looks that looks terrifying. Hey. Wow. I bet it looks good on your 360 cam. I'll let you know soon. If you want any footage, I'm happy to send stuff. Yeah. Over. That's the way. Yeah. That's the safest way. Yeah, you never know whether this is going to give. It yeah, no. And wherever there's laid, you can sleep away very easy. easy yeah. It's not worth it. I don't know. I don't know. I, I think it's I think I'm seeing the bottom, I'm just thinking of the angle I'm seeing, I'm just seeing angles of... Wow. You can see it better if you walk to the bottom of the wheelhouse than the floor, isn't it? Yeah, but it's just that... That was definitely down. a wheelhouse, was it? Yeah. Yeah, you can see where the big bar would have got across here, isn't it? Yeah. From the yeah. Below. yeah, you, you can feel it, isn't it? It's... Uh, yeah. It's not a good feeling, is it? Yeah. No. What I did is I did that kind of thing. And yeah, jumped in the air. Scary. Well, I'm just gonna go walking down the valley thing and have a look at another added. There's plenty of them around. You down? Man down! Follow the miners' path is always the better, is it? Yeah. Because they've got to be mines along those. So where that waterfall there, we're heading to sort of the top of that, which is along that path. We've sort of got to try and make our way down there. Yeah, you can see the miners' path right there. That's where we need to head off. Oh. All right, yes, I can see where you're going to go down there. All along there down the ridge, across, and up that nice path there. They don't know what straight line Okay, I've never seen that before. Where? It's up at a waterfall, I've just noticed that before. I've literally never, I've never ever seen that before. It's that next waterfall by here, sun's, isn't it? I think it's the sun's yeah. coming out. Yeah. I've Hopefully. never seen that before in my life. I don't think that's on any of the plan either. That's not weird. I don't think there's a So it looks like we're going to go up that mine portal there, all the way uphill again. And then after that, we're going to come down the valley and explore several laddies that are along here. So it's going to be a full exploration day today absolutely incredible i feel exhausted but it's so exciting and exhilarating see that site over there see them lines in the run and they're the bronze age hashing so they used to water, uh, run the water in leaks over there uh wait until the water built up really high then left it down the mountain and he used to like erode all the soil then they just mine out whatever they can oh find. that's what it is then in then valley indentations yeah, that's called, it's called hushing bronze safe bronze age mining that's it and they found uh, the oldest piece of gold was found here it was like four thousand year old bit of gold found up here and it's like a prince cereal oh, sundial yeah look. wow it's like a milk bottle top Crazy. Yeah, so instead of digging it out, they would just let the water build up and build up, they would let it down the mountain really quick and just pop all the top soil away. Genius, that is, isn't it? Ingenious, isn't it? I'd, I'd come up with that rather than digging it by hand, anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Get evidence of that. Let do water do its job, yeah? Yeah, just let the water do its job, really. It just makes life so much easier. And back then, it was all stone bone as well, wasn't it? They didn't even have the proper tools. Yeah, I think it's 4,000 years old that's under this course, that's crazy. 
I've never been to other points in now. This is completely new to me. Yeah, let's go and explore it. It's quite interesting though, isn't it? Yeah. We found the mine. Wow. Look at this. Right next to the waterfall. I'm going to wait on you for this one, so I'll take the voice out first. <laughs> <laughs> Push him in, yeah. Kick him in. <laughs> wow. 